Hi, my name is Seti and welcome back to another Tips and Tricks with Apps Events and Acer. In today's video, we will be looking at Google Sheets and how easy it is to apply a theme to your sheets. Now, this not only changes the way it looks, but also how your data is represented visually when you have lots of charts added into your sheet. So let's go on to the computer. I'm now in my Google Sheet and as you can see, I have a table on the left, I have a first bar chart, a pie chart, and then here I have my scorecard, which calculates the total of all the votes. Now, I could go and manually change all the fonts and font sizes, background colors, colors of the chart, but it's much easier to use a theme. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to go to the top, Format, and then select Theme. Now you have a number of predefined themes here. So we have this standard theme, which is what you can see now. We have these simple lights. And as you can see, as soon as I click on that, everything changes, the font changes, the colors change. I can choose any of these other themes for my sheet. Now this will really help you to tidy up your presentation and your sheet and make it visually appealing. Now in some cases, you'll want to use your brand or school colors, Well, you can do that as well. Let's go back to the top and select our standard theme. Now I'm going to click on customize. Once you've clicked on customize, you can now choose your brand or school font and colors. So let's change the font. The default is Arial, so we're going to change that. I'm going to go with Georgia. I'm going to scroll down. I want my text to be a dark blue color. That will be my standard. I want my chart backgrounds to be a light blue. So let's go ahead and select a very light blue. There we go. And then we can choose our accent colors. Now, I'm just going to change a few of these. I'm going to randomly select a bunch of colors. But again, you can make sure that you're using your school colors. And as you're changing these, the theme automatically applies to your Google Sheets. Now, as you can see at the bottom, edits to this theme will be saved over the existing custom theme. So once you've changed it, it is in place for your next sheet or your next spreadsheet. Now, this is incredibly useful to make sure that your spreadsheets are consistent in how your charts are represented visually. Once you've finished, you can click on Done. And from now on, that custom theme is right here at the top. Let's say that you want to go back to your standard theme. Well, that is still available right here. The custom theme, that's the one that you change. So from now on, whenever I want to use that custom theme with my school colors, it is available for me in my theme selector. Now do let us know in the comment section below, does your school require you to use the school colors or school branding? If they do, have you tried out the theme functionality to make sure that everything is on brand? Now, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel. This was another Tips and Tricks with Apps Events and Acer. In the meantime, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.